Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant and I'm going to have a talk to you about this beautiful Mercedes-Benz. This particular car is a December 2005 ML500. It's got the 5 litre V8 with a 7 speed gearbox. It's in immaculate condition inside and out. It's one owner from new was purchased at G Brothers Mercedes-Benz and every single service up until 113,000 kilometres has been done at the same dealer. It's done 118,000 kilometres now and we'll probably arrange to have an oil change done. Even though it's not due yet. It's got memory seats, drivers and passenger side. It's got the two-tone leather and suede seats, reverse camera, navigation. It's got dual zone climate control. The click of a button you can put the suspension up a little bit if you are using it off-road. This is hill descent control and this here if you press that it actually works with the ESP and ABS system for off-road use. You've also got a comfort and sport mode um, which basically means if you are off-road and you're going over bumps, you can put it into comfort. Or if you're driving around town, or if you're on the open road and you're going into corners, you can put it in sport mode and the car will lower a little bit and handle significantly better. It's got a beautiful set of Mercedes-Benz five-spoke alloy wheels and it's got four Pirelli Scorpion tyres. I've had the same ones on my cars and they've been fantastic. They're quiet and they seem to last a very long time. The back seats fold down, the air conditioning is ice cold. But it's just so rare to find a, any Mercedes, or an ML for that matter, in this condition with a full Mercedes-Benz logbook history from you. Unbelievable. It's got a tow bar, which is Mercedes-Benz. tinted windows but probably the best thing about this car is the service history and the condition is outstanding like I say to people sometimes I'm sure if you went online you're probably going to find one a little bit cheaper but I don't think it's going to be in as good a condition as this car I don't think it's going to be black with black interior with every service done at Mercedes Benz two remote keys from new and a nice set of Pirelli tyres I have driven it, it drives beautifully and would suit a very fussy buyer. I think it says the average fuel consumption on it at the moment is about 14 or 15 litres per 100 kilometres. I think that's pretty good. I find in the diesels, I get, I get personally about 11 and a half litres per 100 k's to 12 litres around town. And you've got the performance in the theatre of a V8 and for the sake of two or three litres per 100 kilometres, I'm not sure, is it worth getting a diesel? I don't know. But this has my favourite five-spoke alloy wheel on the W164ML. I think they look fantastic. It's a great colour. It's a luxury. It's got the smoked tail lights, which look a lot better, which is standard on the luxury. got keyless entry, keyless start, keyless start switch isn't on there at the moment but it does have one. But even when you look here you can see that this is nice and clean, the steering wheel, usually these get really grubby and sticky. Let's have a look here. Yeah so with the uh, push button start in these Mercedes, I'll just put it in here, there we go. once it's been taken out it must have been cleaning and they're cleaning around it. So to start the car you just put your foot on the brake and you press that and it starts up basically if you've got the key on you. But it's got automatic headlights, automatic wipers, I think it's pretty nice, it's got every option you could possibly get at the time that I'm aware of anyway. Harman Kardon sound system. 
just given it a quick wash. It still needs a detail, but it's pretty good. Back seats work really well. You just lift up the back like this. And then this folds down flat. So you've got a completely flat surface to work with. It's just those little things which, which make it great. I mean, for me, looking at a car like this, you've got performance, you've got reliability, you've got the look, you can put your family in it, you can take it off-road, you can tow boats with it. I love E500s and S500s. You can't drive those on a dirt road or tow a boat realistically. These are very easy to get in and out of. And it's just one of those cars, I can't stop looking at it. It looks great from every angle. If you'd like to come and see this car for yourself, come down and have a look. We're located in Marrickville. We're 20 minutes from Sydney Airport. And if you have any questions, please feel free to give us a call. You can ask for myself, Philip or Richard. We'd be more than happy to help you. Thanks again for watching.